So you're sitting there ready to dive into your favorite game on your trusty PS4, and suddenly, disaster strikes. An error message pops up on your screen, and it reads, error code CE3001-4. An error has occurred. Panic sets in and you start to wonder what went wrong and how you can fix it. Well, fear not, because I'm here to guide you through the process of fixing this pesky error code. First things first, let's understand what this error actually means. Error code CE3001-4 usually indicates a problem with the system software or a corrupted file on your PS4. It can be caused by a variety of factors, such as a power outage, interrupted system update, or even a faulty hard drive. Now let's get down to business and fix this error. The first step is to turn off your PS4 completely. Yes, I know it's hard to say goodbye to your gaming session, but trust me, it's necessary. Once your console is off, unplug the power cord from the back of the PS4 and wait for at least 30 seconds. This will ensure that any residual power is drained from the system. After the waiting period, plug the power cord back in and turn on your PS4. Now, we need to boot your console into safe mode. To do this, press and hold the power button on the front of the PS4 until you hear a second beep. This usually takes around seven seconds. Once you hear the second beep, release the power button. You should now see the safe mode menu on your screen. Using your controller, select the option Rebuild Database and press the X button. This process might take some time, so be patient and let it do its thing. Rebuilding the database will fix any corrupted files and hopefully resolve the error code. Once the database rebuild is complete, your PS4 will restart and hopefully the error code CE3001-4 will be a thing of the past. If, by any chance, the error persists, you might need to consider more advanced troubleshooting steps, such as reinstalling the system software or replacing the hard drive. But for now, let's hope that the database rebuild did the trick. So go ahead, grab that controller, and get back to your gaming adventures. Remember, if you encounter any other issues or have further questions, don't